This video is over my 2001 Dodge Ram 1500 Laramie Edition with the 59360 in it. Uh, I'm just here to show you all my Rough Country leveling kit. I got this back at Christmas time. It's now May 13th and uh, I've loved the heck out of it. It improves the ride a ton. Makes the ride a lot smoother. It takes bumps very well. Um, it improves the look of it, that's for sure. I had 33 inch mud tires on here, but they were bald and like they were in pretty bad condition, but my buddy gave them to me for free. And I finally busted one of them this weekend and had to put these stock wheels back on, but this thing's nice, freaking love it. And uh, I'm making this video now. I should have made this a long time ago, but I'm making this video now because I just ordered my five inch Rough Country suspension lift kit. I'm gonna be putting on there pretty soon. Let me get you a look at it. It's just like a little bushing that sits down in there. It's pretty sweet. It's definitely worth the money. It was a pretty fun process because there are like three main bolts here. There's three right here. And then there's one down here you got to take off. I think this is the one you just take off. And uh, after that, the coil spring and the shock come, come, they both come off. And actually, I think you just have to take the coil spring off, but you still have to take that bottom piece off. And, uh, and then you put that up on then in there and then wedge that coil spring back in there and then you're sitting two and a half inches higher in the front and I love the heck out of it I might sell it I might keep it I don't know once I get this suspension lift on there because it's only supposed to have four inch blocks in the back plus shocks and then I think it, it might be five inch up front. So if it's already um, uneven, I won't be putting the two and a half inches in front. But I mean, it looks really good in my opinion. I don't like the small wheels that I had to put back on my truck. This thing looked really good and sat a lot higher with the mud tires on there. And yeah, it fits 33 inches on there well with the leveling kit. I'm looking to put some bigger ones on here. Some like 35 inches or something on once I put my 5 inch on and I'll have a video for that too yeah it just doesn't look near as good with these small tires on there sucker handles work well I got quarter inch wheel spacers on with this leveling kit you can't really tell about the coil in, or the, the you can't really tell about the spacers wheel spacers I mean I'll begin the one and a half inch wheel spacers here once I get my five inch lift. But I just wanted to show you all my truck with the leveling kit on before I throw the lift on there. Sure love this thing. Sorry if this video is crappy, I can't really see that well. It's a little dark on my phone. But yeah, I love the thing. It's a really easy process and Rough Country tells you all the tools you need and it's only a hundred bucks for these for a pair of these spacers. Which in my mind's a good deal, so thank y'all for watching. Subscribe if you want. I don't really need subscribers or whatever because I don't update that much, but I just like updating and showing y'all and doing reviews and kind of crap like that. So thank you for watching. There you go.